What is up YouTube? We are doing a swimwear haul today. I personally haven't ever tried this company. This is a sponsored video, so I didn't pay for any of these, but I'm gonna tell you how I really feel about every single one. Full disclosure, full honesty, because I've heard some not so great things about this company, but I've also heard some pretty decent things about this company. So we are going to be testing out Zaffle swimwear today. I have like, I want to say like 13 bathing suits from them. I did pick all of them out. They gave me like a gift card to use on the website. So I was able to like pick all these styles and, and patterns and colors that I really like. So hopefully I will like most of them, but they were like less than $20, even less than like $15 for most of them. I'm assuming quality isn't gonna be of the highest tier, but not everyone can afford an $80, $100 bathing suit. So here I am with the, the real deal on whether or not these are worth your $15. Let's jump right into it. We have a very dirty FedEx package here. Um, I'm just gonna open this and dump it because I don't want this package sitting anywhere on any of my furniture or carpet. See you later, dirty bag. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 bikinis, excuse me. We have 12 bikinis we are trying on today. I'm gonna open them all up and try them on as we go. Without further ado, starting off plain with white. Ooh, okay, material is nice. Okay, this is just a top. So that's the other thing. Not all of these are bikinis. On the website, they have like bikinis, one pieces, and then just like individual tops and bottoms. So I did buy some tops. I also thought these would double for like good gym tops. So this is a little halter top. It is a white backless draw, drawstring, this is not a drawstring, white backless tie halter top. And it actually, like the material feels really nice. It has a ribbed pattern. It's kind of like knit. I don't know how well this would hold up like in a pool or in the ocean, but let's try it on and see how it goes. I absolutely love this. And also want to say, I don't do boob pads, so I'll be taking the pads out of all of these. So if you're not a person who likes to expose their nipples through their shirt, keep in mind that all the boob pads are out. So if I had boob pads in, you probably wouldn't be able to see my nipples, but I just do not do boob pads. So anyway, it is a little bit tight around this bottom elastic piece, um, which might be kind of annoying, but to be honest, I really, really, really like this top. It's super cute. I like the the fit and the style with like the halter top and everything. I'm absolutely so excited to wear this, to be honest with you. Jumping right into the colors, we have this Flower Power Vibe bikini. It's all right. Oh, I actually love that. So the top isn't a tie, it's just like a a strict halter top so this might not work for somebody who has like larger breasts I do not however so hopefully this is a good fit they also don't have an extra small they only have smalls and everything and I would have bought an extra small and everything because that's typically what I would wear but that's okay we're gonna you know we're gonna make it work and then these are the bottoms they're gonna be very cheeky let's try them on and see what we think I lied about this not working if you have big boobs because if you have small boobs it probably won't work either. It also might be because I have large traps because I work out quite a bit but I, I don't, maybe it's supposed to look like that but I don't, I don't think so. Like any swift movement and my, my nipples will, my, it will be up here. There was, there is no functionality in this. Um, so if you have, like, if you have big boobs, like, don't even think about buying this. This is not going to be comfortable. You will constantly be walking around like this. I mean, it's a really cute bathing suit. The bottoms are really cute and they fit really nice, but, uh, <laughs> nope. <laughs> No, thank you. No, thank you. Big traps, big boobs. Unless you have like a very, very small frame, this is probably not gonna be the jam. Although I am not with the trends, so maybe it's supposed to be like this, because I know some bathing suits like show a little under boob and like that's the thing now, but I don't like that, so. Next. Ooh, okay, I think this is another top. 
Oh, love this. Okay, it's kind of the same vibe as the last one's got like ribbed, but it's this cute tie-dye. This feels a little bit more like swimsuit material, so I feel like this would hold up better like in the pool, but I still don't know if I would trust that. I think I'm just gonna wear these as tops, but it is really cute, so let's see what it looks like on. Once again, with that bottom seam, it's just a little tight. This one has more stretch than the white halter top, but yeah, that seam is just kind of tight, like if I just like totally relax, it's just kind of not the most comfortable. I still really like it and I'm absolutely going to wear it to the gym like all the time. But yeah, if you're like not a person who enjoys that, um, not that I enjoy it, but I'll deal with it if that makes sense. Super cute though, really plain and simple. The tie dye is cute, fits well in every other area. And I actually really, I like it. We've got two different patterns going. So I typically don't like animal pattern things, but I thought this was really cute. It has like a Dalmatian pattern on the actual like coverage pieces and then the straps are like a cheetah print. I don't know, I really liked that um, and I thought it was super cute. And then same with the bottoms. I'm a little worried because these ones don't tie, but hopefully they fit nice anyway. Let's try them on and give them a whirl. Wow, for a $15 bathing suit, I really, really like this. Top and bottom both fit really well. I, I have nothing bad to say about this. If you have a love for animal print and you're down with some cheekier bottoms, I recommend. What do we got? Oh, fun. Okay, so this is an actual, like, ribbed bikini. Okay, these bottoms have, I feel like, a little bit more coverage than the other ones. It's just a plain, like, cream ribbed set. Oh, the top's super cute, too. A little different, and it's going to fit kind of weird. Um, I might have issues getting into that, but let's see what we can do. <laughs> First of all, love these bottoms. They're a little bit more coverage. But very functional. I'm just like super active at the beach or usually at the pool. Like I don't just like lay there. These are just like right up my alley. Now this top, I don't think I'm wearing it correctly. I have it on like this, which is how it came. But I don't think that's super functional. Like all I have to do is like boop and like it's off. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna tie it a different way. Excuse me for a moment. Okay, yes. So I retied it where I put this bottom strap around my back with the other one. So now I've got double ties in the back, double protection, double functionality. And then I just halter tied the top one like a typical bathing suit top. And like, dude, I'm ready to, I'm ready to go crazy in this. Um, I actually really, really like this, to be honest with you. I'm not sure how it's going to do in the pool. It might be see-through when I get in, like when it gets wet. But hey, it's a risk I'm willing to take because I really like this. And there's also other colors if you don't want to get white, but I just so happen to choose white. So on to the next one. Okay, this one looks really cute. Who doesn't love a good sunflower? Oh, okay. I got really, d okay, this looks tiny. This looks absolutely tiny. Is this just a small? Okay. Um, yeah, the sizing's kind of weird on a lot of these. This looks absolutely microscopic. Um, I think my boobs are gonna be like, I think my nipple is literally gonna be right here at the end, but hey, can't judge a book by its cover. And the bottoms are just plain black. Oh, I actually really like how these look. I'm such a plain gal. Like, I tried to venture out for you guys in this video and get like some fun colors and styles, but my heart goes out to those plain, those plain Jane vibes, dude. Do not buy this. As I presumed, this, this top is literally a risk to wear on camera. Um, first of all, it took me 30 minutes to get it on. And dude, my nipples are it, less than an inch of, like away from from being exposed um, yeah I feel really uncomfortable in this top despite the top the bottoms are cute they're super super cheeky um, I, I like them and I'm definitely gonna wear them with like a different top but like dude do not buy this top this is bottom of the line dysfunctional it's really cute. Pattern's cute, but like, dude, absolutely not. I am not like super gifted up top, and the fact that this is a small, and like you can see this much of my boob, 
Like, dude, that's all boob, right? That, no. Nope, next. I think this is just another top, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, love this. So cute, I didn't realize I got all these ribbed styles. So it's just a cute, like, deep V top. This is still not super, like, bathing suit material. Maybe some of these are just for, like, going to the pool but not actually getting in, you know what I mean? Let's try this on. These tops just keep getting better and better. First of all, very flattering for your girls. It's super stretchy. Love the color, love the fit, love the style. Not one thing bad to say about this. I think these tops were literally like eight, like seven to eight dollars too. Amen. Oh, okay, I remember ordering this. So this one's a bit different, a bit different. I've never had a bathing suit like this. So the bottoms are like, it's like a one piece, but not. They're like overalls. Oh gosh, this looks, this looks kind of big. The sizing looks so weird. So they're like overalls, and then you have this cute little tube top that goes, I don't know how I'm gonna hold this and show you, that goes on the inside like so. I don't know if you can see the vibe. We'll just put it on and I'll show you what I mean. Not like super functional for like tan lines, but cute for, for like Insta pics and, and you know, like the, the aesthetics of it all. How fun is this? It is worthy to note that this doesn't come with boob pads, so if you're a person who likes boob pads, um, this doesn't come with any and you can't put any in. So I thought it was going to be a little bit lower cut. Maybe that's because I have it like hiked so high, but I feel like then I'd be baggy if I like lowered the straps a little bit. It's cute. I'm probably not going to wear it super often. Uh, it's just not like the most functional thing I've ever seen. And the back is, like, has a little bit of gapping. Um, it's just a little loose right there, so. Not my favorite, not the best quality. Like, I definitely feel like the other suits have, like, a little bit higher quality material than this. It's fun. It's exciting. I don't recommend it. I really, really liked this pattern. It was almost, it's almost like a checkered vibe, but not. And then I do, I just love a good cup with an underwire because like if I'm going to the beach and I'm gonna be running around playing football or something or like just like swimming around, I feel like this is like very functional. And I'm super excited to try this on. These bottoms look a little bit higher waisted than some of the other ones, but um, let's try it on and see if it fits. I really like these cups. I love this. I'm so excited to wear this this summer. A little bit more coverage once again. I love like the lower cut bottoms. The pattern is so, so cute. Colors are cute. I, I literally love this. I love it so much. 10 out of 10, recommend. I did a really good job with like variety this time. This is actually just another top and this is much more swimsuit material than the other ones I got. Super cute, like these are gonna be so good when I visit my partner in California and we do like beach runs or like something cute like that. I really, really, really like this. And once again, just killed it on all these different colors I got. Let's try it on and see what it looks like. So this is probably the least favorite of all the tops I've bought. This is definitely a lot tighter than the other ones. The other ones are still tight, but this is like very annoying. I might like not even wear this at all. It's just, it's super plain. I wouldn't spend like $8 on it. You could probably get one at like Target. That's a little bit more functional and higher quality for $8, so. The last two, the last two melons, oh, are kind of, wait, is that black? Oh, that's black. I was about to say they're Christmas colors because I thought this was green, but it's black. So not Christmas colors, but oh, another top. I didn't realize I got, I didn't realize I got so many of these. So this is a one shoulder, very much more of a swimsuit material than the other ones. Um, but I think that's going to be really fucking cute. I'm super excited to try that on. Mm, let's try this on. Every time I've bought this style, I just feel like I look so boxy and just weird. It's, it's actually a really cute top though, not gonna lie, the back is adorable, but the front, I just look fucking... I just, I don't know, it's not my favorite. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments if I should uh, rock this or not. And last but not least, okay, it's, it is a bikini. So I did get one plain black bikini. I did my best, you guys, to stay away from these for the most part. But these bottoms have like cute little knots in the sides. I thought that was pretty cute. 
Um, and they, it does look like it has a little bit more coverage in the back. Um, to be honest with you, I have a pretty big butt, so when I say coverage, after like two steps, it's going to be up my butthole anyway, so. Oh, and this top is cute too. It's got like a little matching knot in the, in between the, the breast cups. Super cute. Let's, uh, let's try this on and save the, the plainest for last. The last bathing suit of the haul. Bum, ba, da, da. <sighs> Love it. Literally, dude. Okay, in terms of like comfort, this is definitely probably numero uno. The material is just like really nice and stretchy and like I just feel so held in right now. I can go run a marathon in this. The knots on the bottom are in kind of different spots, which is a little bit annoying, but we don't care. For less than $15, we don't care. This top also flatters my upper area very nicely. Bottoms are definitely pretty cheeky. Back's cute. Love it. Love that we just ended this off on a good note. I was very much expecting for this to be like a total flop try-on haul. But to only like absolutely hate two of the 12 bikinis, I definitely underestimated Zaffel. Once again, the quality isn't like top notch, but for less than $15 a suit, fuck yeah, dude. I, they, have, they have my vote. There's gonna be some styles and fits that just like don't work for you, but like to have a majority of those like fit really well and honestly love like Gosh, like 50% of those. I'm in, like, I'm really excited to, for this summer and like all these cute suits that I have to wear. And like the tops were great. As I said, completely underestimated this haul. So if you'd like to try any of the styles, they're all linked below. And then they gave me a discount code. If you use Tasha22, you can actually save 22% on all of your orders. I don't believe I get any commission on that. However, they might be keen on like allowing me to do more hauls if you guys do use that discount code plus you get 22 percent off your whole entire order so definitely don't miss out on that thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in the next one